The only thing in those six months that gave me gave me hope for a, a, a normal life. I felt relieved. Like I, I felt like I was given a second chance. So my name is Casey Ramada. I'm 38. Uh, I live in Seattle, Washington, and I'm a project manager for a private security uh, equity firm. So the symptoms I had was I, I thought I was just tired. You know, I th thought my diet was off, and uh, I was randomly throwing up. But I thought it was stress related from just working a ton. I didn't realize that it was a, a kidney issue, and then the kidney, the throwing up, is what caused me to get pneumonia. So I was diagnosed with a kidney disorder uh, in uh, 2007. Wasn't really related how severe it was. During all the blood tests, they found out that my kidneys were failing and I had stage five kidney disease. So that kind of led me down the path of what to do. When I had pneumonia, I was throwing up blood, which was a, a big indicator, but uh, all my levels were messed up. So my creatinine levels were messed up. My, my bun level was messed up. I was anemic. Yeah, my blood tests just were completely out of whack. So the treatments that were recommended to me were dialysis and a transplant, but it's a, it's a, a, a life altering situation. And this is the one thing that, you know, for about six months, I thought that I was going to be relegated to change career fields, which I don't want to do. So that's what led me down the alternative path. So uh, I first visited the Simpson Institute in October of last year. The day after Thanksgiving, I went back to the gym for the first time and I received treatment the last week in October. So it was about three and a half weeks from the time that I received treatment to the time that I was starting to live a normal life again. And it's a normal, it's kind of a, a, a new normal, but it's it was definitely improved my life. And then I also have had a, a lot of uh, positive, good things happen that weren't targeted, right? Like, because in my time in the military, my back was all jacked up and I haven't had back spasms in the last six months since my first treatment. Uh, my tinnitus is better. I was just all around, just a, just a, just a healthier life. Booking with the Stem Cell Institute was actually really easy. You know, I emailed just a quick, like, introduction of my, myself and my situation and I heard back within probably about 48 hours. Uh, connected immediately with the doctors, was going back and forth with the doctors, they thought that they could help. And I was booked and ready to come down, I believe, in about two weeks after the first interaction. So my interaction with the staff has been nothing but positive. Everyone's been courteous, professional. They're, they try to guess your needs before you have them. Uh, the booking agents, they are in constant communication. The billing department's awesome. I can't recommend the staff at the Simpson Institute enough. They're, I can't think of any negative uh, interaction I've had since being here. I don't have any fears. I would mean I was apprehensive, right? Because when you look on paper, like uh, like st stem cells, you know, they're, they're doing so much for so many people. So if I have to talk to anybody who's on the fence about it, I'd say do it. Like even reaching out, seeing if you guys can help. The honesty is extremely nice and refreshing, which I think is honorable. <laughs>